gathered at the Biloxi Town Green to run for a special cause. Disability Connection hosted its annual Arbor 5K run, which supports people with living, uh, living with disabilities. Several organizations, including Ainsley's Angels, participated. Leslie Rojas tells us more. Running a 5K while pushing a wheelchair is no easy task. But 11-year-old Drayson Cuevas was up for the challenge. Well, um, I'm going to be pushing my little sister. Uh, her name is Evie Cuevas. And, um, and uh, we're going to be running a 5K, pushing her about three miles maybe. And, um, and there are a bunch of other people out here who are going to do the exact same thing. <laughs> When that horn blew, runners made their way down the streets of downtown Biloxi for the annual Arbor Day 5K, which supports people with disabilities. I'm a teacher and event coordinator at a uh, 501c3 public um, Christian ministry in Savannah, Tennessee. And so what we do is for children and adults with special needs. So it's dear to my heart. I'm passionate about it and I'm grateful to um, be able to be here and support that cause. From old to young, the event gives people with different disabilities a chance to compete. This is an opportunity for them to be in a real run, and the, there are some doing the 5K in a racing wheel, wheelchair with Ainsley's Angels. We have people in the one mile and then the quarter mile. A um, lot of people are on wheelchairs, a lot of people are walking um, with walkers. Cuevas told us he and his sister both have autism, which is why this run is extra special. I believe it's very important because a lot of people here have a lot of disabilities. Some people can't even talk clearly or see clearly. So that's why we're going to be uh, encouraging them to uh, in wheelchairs and push them three or maybe a couple more miles. Cuevas plans to continue running and pushing his sister all the way to the finish line to show his support. In Biloxi, Leslie Rojas, WLOX News Now. You can visit disabilityconnection.org to learn more ways to help people with disabilities. The